Hey guys, this is the tutorial for the My Tentai theme of Conan, and we directly start with the intro. The intro for your left hand starts right here. So, at first I play it. Yeah, this is the intro for your right hand. And yeah, first you play A flat, C, and F together. And then you play this. So F, G, A flat, and F. And then you play A flat, C, and E flat. And here. So F, G, A flat, B flat, and C. Then F, A flat, and D flat. Again F, G, A flat, and F. And uh, finally, again F and E. And then again the same. Uh, pardon. the left hand for your intro. You just have to play four different notes. The first is the F and we hit this four times so and then we jump to the A flat and then to the D flat and finally to the C again the same. Okay, together now. When we hit the first chord, our left hand directly starts with the F chord. So, so again. And each time we change the chord here from this to this, um, we also change our left hand. So from F to the A flat part. So again, we jump here. So. And then again, change to uh, the D flat with your left hand. And this chord with your right hand. And finally to the C chord and the F E here. And then again the same. Yeah, this is the intro. And yeah, now let, let, let's come to the to the main part, I think, yes. Here's the main part for your right hand. We start with the A flat. Yeah, and, and we repeat this part twice. So, uh, yeah, it's again the same. I play it again so you can note the notes. So, A flat, G, F, C, A flat, F, G, and then you play this very fast. And yeah, instead of playing this, you can also just play the uh, D flat. But I think it sounds better when you play this, so... And then... Yeah, 
again the same. You can just play, but you can. Uh, I think it sounds better. Uh, yeah, when you uh, if you play this, so very fast. Okay, again from the beginning. So this is the part for your right hand. The first. The part for your left hand is very easy. You start again with the F, and you uh, hit this four times. And then you jump to the E flat, and then to the A flat, and finally to the D flat twice, and the C twice. So uh, I play it again. nearly uh, repeat this, there's just one change, uh, you repeat the F, the E flat, the A flat, but when you uh, play uh, this all uh, for the second time, you don't play, you just uh, hit the C four times, so after the A flat, you play the C, uh, C, uh, C part just the C uh, four times. This is very important for the sound. Yeah, okay, let's uh, do it together. Yeah, start with the intro. When you for the last time hit the C and C here, your right hand starts with the main part, with A flat and G. So, and when you uh, hit the F, your left hand also turns to the F. So, when you hit the D, your left hand turns to the E flat chord. And when you hit the A flat, your left hand also turns to the A flat chord. So. And when you hit the F with your right hand, your left hand turns to the D flat chord. And when you hit the A flat, your uh, with your right hand, your left hand turns to the C chord. So again the same. Change. 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 And change. And when you finally hit this C, your right hand plays, so you play F and G when you hit this C, so, and then when you play the A flat, your left hand uh, again begins with uh, the F, so, when you hit the B flat, your left hand turns to the E flat chord again, so, E flat here, and B flat here. When you hit the C again after your when you hit the C, your left hand turns to the A flat chord. So and you play the uh, C chord after that with your left hand four times without playing something with your right hand. So um, yeah, I think I uh, play it again. part of the main part. 
Yeah, you can think about um, how you want to play this song. Um, yeah, I said uh, that you play uh, this part here twice with your right hand, but um, yeah, when I showed the left hand, I just uh, yeah, showed it for um, playing it uh, one time. So um, I think um, you can play it. Uh, it's important that you uh, hit uh, the C four times when you jump uh, to the next part. You can play the D flat, D flat, C flat, C flat when you want to uh, start a new with um, when you want to start with the. So it's just important that you um, end with the C. If you end with, you can play it uh, again from the beginning. I think, uh, yeah, maybe you can um, hear my uh, my cover version with, uh, yeah, this easy version of uh, this song, and uh, yeah, you can hear uh, if this sounds nice or how you want to play it. Okay, um, now let's come to the uh, last part. If you have questions uh, about what I'm just saying here, um, please uh, ask me uh, with a comment or a PM. I will uh, answer you uh, as fast as I can, I promise. Okay. This is the part after you hit the long C. Then you play. chord with uh, B, D, and G eight times, and then the C chord, C, E, G, four times, and then finally again the G chord. So, After that, you uh, yeah, start again with the. So okay. You end the first part with your left hand with the C, and then you play the F again four times, and then the E flat chord, and then you jump to the D flat chord then to the A flat chord and then to the B flat chord and then to the D flat chord and then you play the G chord G D G also eight times and then the C chord C E and G four times then finally again the G chord. So you play F, E flat, D flat, A flat, B flat, D flat, and G, C, G. These are the chords. Now we're going to play it together. The first part ends with a C here and a C here. And when you play this for the third time, this C, you uh, start with the 
see here again. So and when you hit the A flat here, your left hand turns to the F chord and continues. So I just show the right hand and your left hand plays the F. When you hit the G with your right hand, your left hand turns to the E flat chord. So and when you play the F again, your left hand turns to the D flat chord. When you play the C here, your left hand turns to the A flat chord. So, so. And when you play the A chord, your right hand plays the uh, the A flat and B flat. So, and the C too. When you play the D flat here, your left hand plays the B chord, B flat chord. So, when you hit the F here again. Your left hand plays the D flat chord. And then when you hit the G chord with your right hand, your left hand also plays the G chord eight times. And then the C chord four times. And finally the G chord. So again. Change. Change and change, change and change. Finally, okay, this was. Uh, not the last part, but uh, that's just uh, a short ending. The main part ends with... And it, uh, yeah, at the end you just play... Uh, first you play the same uh, as you uh, played in the uh, main part, so... And now you play here. so important but you uh, yeah I think you uh, could note it and uh, yeah your left hand uh, plays uh, in this part uh, again here the F uh, from uh, yeah, the beginning of the main part four times and again the uh, E flat and then you play the uh, A flat and then you uh, play the D flat here. So uh, wait up, just to look. I think you, uh, yeah, I played. Until here, it's the same uh, as you played in the uh, main part. Yeah, and when you hit here, when you hit here, when you hit the F here. The left hand turns to the D flat chord here. So, so. And after you uh, played the D flat here twice, you jump to the C. Uh, yeah, as you did uh, at the beginning. So uh, I play it again. G here, your left hand turns to the C. So when you hit the F, the last tone with your right hand, your left hand also plays the F chord. So again, 
this part. Yeah, okay, um, yeah, it's uh, an easy version, but I also know that it's not that easy uh, for beginners, but I hope you th that you got uh, yeah, the main parts and uh, that you are able to learn this song, and um, if you have uh, a criticism or something, something like that, um, I would uh, like you to, uh, yeah, to make a comment or, some th or something like that. Um, I can't change uh, my camera positions or um, the quality of my camera. Yeah, I'm sorry, but um, yeah, for the uh, I want uh, I would like to have um, a feedback uh, for uh, the way I present uh, my tutorials and yeah, I hope um, yeah that you uh, could learn something and uh, yeah, adios, ciao ciao, auf Wiedersehen.